Another blue rose. Hmm. How do I get there? Okay, so that's time. Ah, gonna be my third trip. Okay, I cannot grapple from this point. And every time I do, I end up turning left. I'll probably need the dash in order to do that. This, the what is formerly known as Sky Star. You know, the blue rose is actually a tribute, I believe, to Nero from Double May Cry 4 because that was what his double pistol uh, his name had been. Hmm. Probably. There's probably a red queen here somewhere. May not be a flower though. Yeah, that, in fact, that's the closest thing you ever get to seeing anything about Nero again. <laughs> What's sad is he could have actually had a story. Yeah. More than just the one gamer. You'll see Angel Boost. Oh, Dante propels himself forward while airborne. Now you give it to me. <laughs> okay. I gotta say, though, I do like this kind of world right here. In fact, it almost reminds me a little bit about Enslaved. I'm not, I'm not even saying that from the perspective of viewing their art style. I mean, this kind of world. I don't know. This is what I thought Enslaved would be the first time I checked it out. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do that again. At the apex of your jump, yeah, for more distance. Now, where is the next platform? Down there. Keep holding le left stance to extend my boost. Oof, I thought I was gonna fall there. <laughs> Saved me at the last minute. If there's anything else you see here, let me know. Boosted and chained together. Okay, you can double jump and boost. And you can uh, pick up yourself when you're at a ledge. Which is really good to know. Getting the hang of this. I wonder if you get the de there is there a demonic boost now? Hold on. Boost and demon pull can be chained together. No, there is no demonic boost. Uh, it's just a jo double jump whenever I go into an arbiter stance. Okay, that door is there just for cosmetic purposes. Unless this game says otherwise. supposed to be Sparta? I don't know. Please give me a chance to show you. This reminds me of the little ghost masks that you could pick up in Enslaved and you could see some previous point in time. This whirlpool of a Flying flashback. Rats. Pathos. I always said it wasn't better to pull them toward you at that point. Actually, I think it would be better to use them to get what I want here. If I could get them near them. In fact, look at this. Look at the sad thing I'm doing. I'm taking advantage of the enemy step. Like, ooh. what the hell? Did you see that? Yeah. Yeah. Like, I, I end up being on the surface there, and it registers it as ground for a moment. Where is that door? To your left. I know. No, it's right there. No, it's to left. It, left. No, but the door that I need to go with the. No, key. but I mean this door you wanted to get to. Yeah. Early, I'm going to I... use. Look, I'm going to use it to figure out my problem. No. Watch. The. The angel door is over there in the middle of the wall, remember? Hold on, hold on. It's right there, but I want to use the enemy step to do it.
you know, just think of it as a cheat. Secret area is not available during combat. All right, then I'll have to stay up here the whole time. I'm not talking about that door, I'm talking about the actual door. No, but this is the one I was referring to. Yeah, but aren't you gonna get the the, the angel one? Because you can probably do that now. Later. I'm gonna focus on what's in front of me. Yeah, like the fact is you can't get that door unless you get to that first. Well, I'm right here, so I'm not moving anywhere. And in that angel door's in that very plaza. What I'm saying is, why don't you do it? Angel door in which half? The other side. Mm. There's. Yeah, but I'm referring to a secret mission. I guess I could drag one of them up there if it saves me the trouble of looking for a way. Although I am weary of being able to do it through these means. I thought there would be a little more, but hey, I took the easy route. I cheated, so that's probably a lesson there. Although, to be fair, this game allows me to cheat. to do launch it. Launcher it. I mean, that's the way it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be a little delayed. Hmm. But I were just pressing you, it. Since he's the last enemy, instead of... Got it. Oh, there's more. I was gonna say, instead of killing them, do the last one and bring him to you on the platform you want to be. Uh, that a good idea? No, I'm gonna save it for overdrive. Huh. Not so scary. Thing yeah. is, though, you have to look I'm for an open way. window and time it precisely. Okay. Yeah, that that secret mission not available during combat. So what would happen if I attempted to do it now? missed it there. His moving is a little more... I don't know how to put it. Okay, there we go. Not enough arching keys. Okay, so it takes more than one to unlock the door. It looks like it's designed by how many eyes you have. A lot of people say it's eyes. Just just use the term keys, please. And I know they're supposed to look like eyes, and I know it's a reference to Mundus. No, I mean the eyes, literally how many eyes are on the door actually I know. determines. It corresponds to how many keys I have, though. How many I'm supposed to. So now I'm out of limbo. Is this how it's going to be with, with new Dante, though? Am I always going to be fighting in limbo? So I didn't mind seeing classic Dante fight in the street for no <laughs> for not that much of a reason. The world's most powerful investment bank. And who runs it? CEO, Kyle Ryder. A human vessel. The physical manifestation of Mundus, the Demon King. Through debt, he controls everything. Yeah, like a Wall Street reference. A factory farm for human souls. And he likes to keep his animals monitored and docile. The monitoring is done by the Raptor News Corporation, a global network of CCTV cameras, satellites, and spies. Not spies and drones. I mean, not Fox News and drones. <laughs> what is it? It's in your hand. Planet Earth's most popular soft drink, virility. The demons have spiked it. It's okay. It has no effect on us, only humans. Okay, isn't there any so other liquid? Hand. Like so water? Plan? That's the Hellgate. A conduit from which Mundus draws his power. While he's connected to the Hellgate, he's immortal. But we get him away from the Hellgate, and our swords will do the rest. So, how do we do that? We get his attention. 
Mundus is petty. He's impulsive. If we hit him where it hurts, let his anger rule him. I believe we can draw him out. Okay, so to kill Mundus, we need to drag him away from the Hellgate. We do that by pissing him off. Roughly speaking, yes. And we piss him off by taking out the Raptor News Network and Virilla. That's it. Which one do you want to do first? Uh, okay, so that's my score, and let's see what I got. I don't expect to have collected many uh, lost souls, though. I was gonna say proud there for a moment, that's why I hesitated. 20%, oh, you only missed one. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, gotta give myself a pat on the back there. You got an S rank. A little further. It's a little too easy, though. And Devil May Cry 4 did this. Um, the larger the environment, like, I mean, the, the environments were so large, I think that might have been the reason why that getting hit was not really all that detrimental to your score. I really wish this thing had gone the way of Devil May Cry 3, though. I, I'm saying, even 4 was not that perfect, it was not that epic. Three is the standard, for me at least. And this game refuses to follow, but I guess it's alright. Like, I'm not, it's not that I'm having a bad time playing this. There are some unbearable portions, but we've just begun, so a job not yet completed is one just begun. Whatever. Stay tuned, fools.